In my previous video, I addressed the microphone permission problem and how to solve it. And now I would like to show you a way to sort of automate the entire launch procedure so that you can get going fast with AULab. So let's go to the um, My Music folder where I have the freshly downloaded zip file. I'll double click the zip file to extract the app. Now it's been extracted. Let's go to Show Package Contents, Contents, Mac OS, AULab. Now, as soon as you launch the app, um, you get this um, configuration document. And here you choose your inputs and outputs. The input will be the uh, black hole uh, virtual channel. And the output, because I want to um, listen through my speakers, which are connected to my DAC. This is my Bluetooth DAC. I'm going to choose that as the output. And now I'm going to create a document. As soon as I do that, the document gets created, but this is not what we want in order to automate things. What we want is to create a specific document that's going to be launched every time. So um, rather than using the default settings, we go to the AU Lab settings. And here we have this section called document where it gives you all these um, options. And what we want is to rather than open the default dialog box, we want to open a specific document. And we're going to choose that. But first we have to create it and we want to create a sort of a preset. So let's just assume that what you want is to have your um, uh, graphic EQ configured. So uh, let's just choose this set of frequencies and if you press the option key as you're dragging the sliders, you can be very uh, precise and you can choose um, the amount of volume you want. In this case, what 1.5 1 uh, 1 um, decibels. Let's now just take this uh, bunch of frequencies and boost them also by um, 1.5. Let's press the option key. There we go. Okay. So that's our preset. That's how we want the EQ. Now this, we can close this. And now we go to file and we're going to save this untitled document. We're going to save it as and let's just place it in the my music in the music folder and let's call it my eq dot track okay so that's going to be our default document that's going to open every time now we can close this and go back to uh, AU, uh, AU lab settings again and now we're going to have the um, app open a specific document every time so we already have uh, created it so now this is going to be the document that's going to launch every time we um, uh, launch uh, the, the app we can close this let's close terminal terminate okay and now what we want is a shortcut to this um, executable file and for that right click and select make alias and that we can also drag to the music folder and this is going to uh, save us having to navigate through all these uh, directories so we can close this let's go back to the folder and here we have the my eq track um, configuration file for AU lab and we have the alias so what the alias does is it leads to the executable inside the package so let's just click it and see what happens there's terminal and there's AU lab and here's our eq and it's already configured 
and now so you can automate the process now let's see if this will work okay so it works that's it